Good morning. Welcome to the Scrap and Pallet Man channel. Grabbing stuff on the curb. In the trash can. Filling an empty truck. They can keep the pool noodles. this it's metal enough <laughs> should keep the whole bag um what is it is it a game I don't know. yeah i'll leave it in the bag My executive seat, throne, whatever you want to call it. Okay, Mike, we have almost all of the parts for the spaceship. But we need to do some more recycling to get them their parts. Um, yeah, I need a little bit more room than that. You might need to go up front, buddy. Has <laughs> one wheel. I don't need the chicken. It got degraded. Kind of. How degrading. That's gonna be a lot of dust. That's for sure. Ooh. I'm going to get a, a bath, bathed in barbecue dust. Huh. How about this? Uh, kind of. What do you got going on here? Some helium steel, a couple tree chairs, and a bug zapper and a piece of, is that wood no that's not oh but the truck is full man all right let's get this guy straightened up then we can get other stuff on there Take this apart. Nah. Yeah, sometimes to be able to uh, kind of pack, you need to have some stuff here first to pack. Yep. So. All the uh, barbecue dust has come out of this. <laughs> yeah, got some brand new scratches on the truck. Kind of thinking about not picking up that helium steel. DAV. Disabled American Veterans, I believe. 
was a part of the DAV for a while. Yep. Then I like Amvex, Amvets better. As a uh, service organization. Hey, it's more of those <laughs> same poles. That are in the cab of my truck now. about that that's a big old space taker yes it is and we really don't know how much we're gonna pick up today we just don't hmm. should I or should I not Get the saws all, Paul. Just start hacking it up. Hmm. Books. Grammar for communication. Animals. I love animals. Whoa. Uh, that's when you know your lunch. Yeah, I'm going to leave that for right now. Hmm. Yeah. That's a lot of tools. Would you like to play some spades? You know what? I like that. That's keepable. You're keepable. What else is keepable? Yeah, one of my pet peeves, I don't know why, you know pet peeves aren't like, it's something that just annoys me, but it really doesn't matter. You know, it's it's something that's annoying to, to an individual. Okay, I'm missing his metal. Um, yeah, having my door open while I'm scrapping, it just, for some reason, I don't like it. Okay, you know, in case someone else is out scrapping, I'm gonna leave these tools for them. Yep. Push on them. Yeah, I can keep the rest of that stuff. Is that gonna fit? Nope. Fit this way though. So it's with a third week in June, that corn is definitely more than knee high by the 4th of July. Hi, good morning. No, I think I got it. Yeah, luckily it's light. So yeah, but thank you though. Yeah, have a good day. I should have said yes, huh? She's like a nice lady. Now I feel bad. Can I go back in time and say yes? <laughs> Old dog just crossed the road. I'm gonna leave that stuff alone. Hi, old dog. Good morning. I see some exercise equipment. I do, I do. 
pull it over, scrap man. Whee! Oh yeah, that's what the old dog is. Oh. Thanks. Spalding. Ooh, these are very light. You're going into the freezer. <laughs> Sounds like an old gangster movie. Yeah, let's put them in the freezer. Do you come apart? <laughs> put old bolts in there. Uh, yeah, I think it doesn't come apart. I have a friend of mine, whenever she says no, like she's the, the worship leader at my old church and I'll be playing a bass line. She's like, yeah, uh, no. And I'm like, well, which one is it? Yeah or no? <laughs> yeah, that one part, uh, yeah, no. <laughs> like, come on. Yeah, no. This may not be so easy. Really? One little stick almost trips me. Yeah, so that's gonna go. Ooh, tripod. Oh, what is that? I thought it was a box. Nope. Seriously, what is this? Huh. It's a scrap. Hmm. Alright, to get that desk in. One of these has to get kind of scooched. It's a technical term in the scrap business. Some scrap jargon. You gotta get scooched. Hmm. Hey, it does fold down. Cool. You know what? I want you up and out of the way. I do. Can you give me a hand here, real quick? Can you grab that side? Oh. Pick it up. Cool. Thank you. You're stronger than you look. Desk. Yeah, it's been in the basement or something. Whoa, no, no bueno. All right, let's do the drag method. Can we do that? So, flip it. Yeah. Some old Bev, Bev DeVoe songs popped in my head. So, load it, flip it. Yeah. Oh. 
So with my shoulder injury, I can pick up stuff using my biceps. I can push just fine. It's just left arm can't go up. Well, can I? I go on a yeah, but like its own muscles, no. So I can do this because it's lifting, and I can push just fine. But that's heavier than it looks. <clears throat> Now, wait, do I have to? Huh. Should I just leave it like that? Hmm. No, it's gonna have to. Huh. All right, let's do the one arm method of course it catches on something uh, what's it catch the drawers that's what like that's that's the kind of stuff that hurts me is when I really put a lot of effort into something and something catches and like just stops me in my tracks that's the type of stuff that hurts yeah Car's coming. Awesome. Now we got this light fixture. Ooh, that kind of beat me up. here so I load it this way and then down maybe it's kind of heavy and awkward let's try it over with this sunrise can you see oh that tree's kind of in the way there's like a turquoise in that layer i don't know if you can quite see that there's a, a different kind of a blue almost a blue green it doesn't even look real morning ralph morning sam Sometimes I don't have a place to put something before I start taking stuff apart. Yeah, this is landfill, sadly. Um, yeah, I gotta get this or I'm gonna forget it. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yeah, I'll be right there. Wow. Uh. Huh. All 
right. How you doing? All right. Doing roofing? Yeah. All right. Thank you. See you later. Probably should have drove over there. so oh. yeah I'm like one quarter done with my route and if it keeps going at this pace yeah this truck will be full full tie down but it's not gonna fly away mr. brown like them sides in your truck sir mm -hmm. yep this is going to the mower man unless it's locked up well Getting very, very sleepy. Whoa, earwigs. All right, just don't climb into my ear, all right? Let him out, huh? Here, dudes, how about this? You guys want to get out? Hmm? Yeah, let's do that. Let's get you out. I don't want you. There's one, there's the other. drop off that um, one bag. I don't know what it is, a tent or whatever it is. And that spade, just to give me some room in here. It's starting to rain a little bit, or sprinkling. drop this off right now I'm in my mower man's neighborhood just so he knows it's at his house all right it's actually a decent one it's one of the straight um, shaft it's a Murray yeah that'll work I think I saw a baby gate oh dude metal yeah that is metal bends like metal 
another brand new screen frame kit. Cool. It's probably aluminum. Yeah, aluminum enough to go in the front. In the back of the front. I already wrecked them. <laughs> Is that an armoire? That looks nice. Hmm. Sitting on the curb. Let me take a better look at it. Just in case. This is not bad at all. It's this extra little nugget. What? Uh, whatever this is, it's not bad. Maybe. Oh, it's a, it's a desk? Yeah, that's what it's a total desk, and this folds out this way. Ha, oh, are you kidding me? Yep, that there is a desk, that's not an armoire, and a complete. <laughs> this is nifty. Did you say nifty? That I did. Hmm. Yeah. Weather started getting rough. My happy place. But it's busy. Um, that's a big truck. I'm just gonna go get in line here. Kind of. kind of out of the way as I'm sitting here waiting for this truck to finish weighing because he has to weigh his first half and then the last half I come on this comment um, from three hours ago I said uh, hi Paul uh, recently randomly found you on YouTube two days ago I know absolutely nothing about scrapping you're very real and charismatic and I am grateful for you it is easy to forget uh, to be grateful to our God for everything in our lives your prayers and goofy demeanor really made me realize just how much I have to be grateful for. You make it so easy to feel absolute joy in the Lord and what he provides if we just open our eyes and our hearts to it. I think that's what she said. Um, I really needed that reminder today. Really needed it. And I really appreciate you and wanted to say thank you. It's easy to forget to be thankful. And I am humbled by your generosity of spirit and generosity towards others. Thank you for reminding me of that. And thank you, God, for the encouragement through others. God, because sometimes I don't feel. I don't feel it. Sometimes I'm grumpy. Sometimes I'm thinking about stuff I shouldn't be thinking about. And you remind me almost always through others thank you for that lord amen and thank you for patience god right now because i want to finish unloading this because i still have some more of the scrap route to do and i'm feeling good and i want to finish that scrap route and i have a feeling there's some more stuff out there all right He's moving. All right, all right. I'm gonna guess uh, 5,000, oh, five, I'm gonna guess 7,000 pounds right now. 7,000 pounds even. And our weight is not, so 6,900. 6920 so I saw this shop um, it's really nice it's 
Um, it has a big garage door and uh, a couple of uh, like rooms for like um, for storing stuff. And it was probably 1,500 square feet, maybe 2,000 square foot shop. And the rent was $2,500 a month. <laughs> I said, thank you, uh, but uh, yeah, I can't quite do that. Because my current rent's $200. <laughs> yeah. $200 and it's, I don't have any electricity, I don't have any other bills. You know, the electricity is included and um, yeah, I can do that. I certainly can. Um, are we good here, bro? Am I making them? Um, you know what? I'm gonna go a little bit more out of the way. Yeah, let's do that. Hopefully I'm not getting people dizzy. Sorry. Am I in your way right here? Okay. Mower man could use this. Ah, a bucket of goodies. Yeah, it's starting to sprinkle. So pardon me if there gets a raindrop on the lens. Raindrops keep falling on my head. Long as scrap doesn't fall on my head, I'm good. Yep. For right now, let's get this desk disembarked. I guess this one needs to go first. Oh, no, it doesn't. I can't tell. Something is pulling. It's a clutch. Okay, I don't want this bouncing back onto the bed of my truck. That's what I don't want. Probably right there. Without catching on that. All right, wish me luck. Yay. Really? How did that at? I don't get it. Okay. I'm gonna untie this first. Okay. This first. Right, this is awkward. Something's catching.
All right, Mr. Grill. Oh, the rope's catching this one. Struggling. <laughs> really? What is I get so frustrated with this? <laughs> yeah, stuff just catches on the lips of things. Yeah, that's all metal. And the chicken grates. Get out of here. Uh-oh. Gonna be a mess here. All right, I'm going off the curb. All right, so if I was 6,920, um, probably 60, 6,300 even. Yeah, 6260, that's good. Can't do math, but that's good. <sighs> All right, any cars coming? Nope, and yep. <laughs> so quick, get out of the way. <sighs> All right, I'm kind of out of the road, right? What's up, man? <laughs> to get thirsty? Right? <laughs> you want to get the, the empty roll off on wholesale? Thanks, Michael. See I'll see you, man. This is just crazy. That load was $96. <laughs> 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96 bucks. $300 in that ton. That's what I'm talking about. Thanks, God. Thank you, Lord. Wet scrap is still good scrap. Yeah, let's go finish the route. Some Swiffer action. Or Swiffer uh, type. We good? Steel. So it's just regular plug. Hmm. 
yeah, it's like it rains and stops and rains and stops. All right, all right. Necessarily want this part. Or this part. And we'll take the rest. I can't win. I thought I pulled up further. All right, I had to remember to put you back. Dude, you're not in bad shape. Are you? Are you my new grill? For the house? Maybe. Definite maybe. Should have probably poured that out. <clears throat> Sorry. on my glove <sighs> all right Those gloves are getting changed out without the grease <laughs> I'll put these on and I got those and I have another set climb into the truck I just um, no I want it f actually flat so let's do that Windy. Those clouds don't even look real. Seriously. Uh, all right, I'm gonna tie this up and get going. What's up, Robin? Helium steel. Hmm. That was not the most pleasant sound. Pallets in the trash. Those are good looking pallets, too. Let's get them. You're not going to no landfill. You're going to a scrapyard. That's right. All right, you got a little bit of an issue, but I think the scrapyard will be able to handle you just fine. Um. Yeah. Yeah, you 
you're gonna have to go somewhere else, buddy. My trident. Perfect pallet right there. Normally I'd pick them up, just carry them, but not lately. doing this yeah something like that and then we'll get the grill I think I have enough rope to go across that the grill right here. Let's do it. Just in case, a whole bunch of copper in there or something crazy. <laughs> really? More burgers? No, thank you. Love a clo fitch. It's just a fantastic little rope trick. You, you cool if I recycle your metal? You can have it. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. What's that? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yep. Oh yeah, thank you.
Yeah. You're hooking me up. Yeah. Hey, if you come back a little bit, I might have... All right. I'll Please do my circle. Garage I can get to. All right. Yeah, if you put stuff out on the curb, either I or one of the other scrappers will grab it because the the prices have just gone through the roof. So, I mean, a truck loads a hundred bucks now. So, yeah, we're out here. Thank you. I got like one small neighborhood with maybe 10 streets left. You'd think the rain would just wait a little bit. Have some patience. Have a little patience. Yeah. On the last street on my route, I get the Ozzy Osbourne of scrap. <laughs> uh. All right, so I'm not gonna go to the scrapyard right now. No, I'm gonna leave it in the truck for a little while. Maybe till this afternoon, something. I'm gonna go home, get some lunch. Thanks for hanging out. You're awesome. God, you're awesome. Thank you for this day. Thank you for this rain. We need it. Our crops need it. Ah, you're amazing, God. This rain feels good, actually. In the name of Jesus, amen. But on my way home, what do I see? I see a train speeding past me. Wait. Yeah, this isn't sped up at all. This is actually how fast the train's going. That's what? 70 miles an hour? Yep. My guess is 75 miles an hour that train's going. I mean, honestly, picture a car going this fast. Yeah, that's nuts. <laughs> Here's the end. Bye. Nice seeing you.